What is going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Equal Espresso and welcome to today's second video up on my channel. That's the first time in a while that I've been putting up two videos in one day, but this one is very important. However, if you're watching this on Carnage's channel, this is something just as important, just as something amazing. We're going to be beating a lot of news sources to this information with this video. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So for those of you guys that do not know, today is a big day for Extinction. As there was a new trailer that was put out on Call of Duty's channel a couple hours ago, that's going to be in-depth broken down on my channel tomorrow, but that's not what we're going to be covering today. We got something else to cover in Extinction because today we've got for you the achievements, trophies, whatever you want to call them for Extinction from the Devastation DLC pack. Now, I'm not going to hold this up for you guys too much. Let's just go right into it. I'm going to put them on screen right now so you can follow along. First, we have the Belly of the Beast, which has reached the cargo area in Mayday in regular or hardcore difficulty. Come up for air, reach the top of the deck in Mayday in regular or hardcore difficulty. Survived Mayday, kill the Kraken for the first time in Mayday in regular or hardcore difficulty. Upping the ante, kill the Kraken using a relic in Mayday in regular or hardcore difficulty. Mayday completionist, complete all challenges and kill the Kraken in Mayday in regular or hardcore difficulty. Inquisitive mind, find all the intel in Mayday. Deforestation, kill 15 cedar turrets in one game in Mayday in regular or hardcore difficulty. Big game trapper, use a hypno trap to turn a rhino friendly in Mayday in regular or hardcore difficulty. Extra devastation, complete the extra XP challenge and then destroy destroy the hive in the devastation DLC map pack and the architects successfully build all the schematics in mayday in regular or hardcore difficulty so with all that being said you're going to be right in the mid 200 range for gamer score or trophy points whatever you want to decide to look at them as but these offer some very cool insight into the new episode of extinction now based on the first two we know that this is going to be a multi-tiered thing similar to what we've seen previously but more on a linear standpoint where it's up and down vertical rather than spread across about a map in multiple different ranges of buildings. That covers the first two, the Belly of the Beast and Come Up for Air, Survive Mayday and Upping the Ante are pretty much given to you just for completing the end game sequence and defeating the Kraken for this episode of Extinction. Now my guess is it's going to be a lot tougher with a relic as it was with previous episodes of Extinction, but those ones are given to you immediately for completing Mayday. Now Mayday Completionist is the same thing as defeating the Kraken, completing Mayday itself, but also completing all the challenges in it. Now Exquisitive Mind, we get to see the return of the intel and the continuation of the back storyline in Extinction with this Mayday chapter. Now Deforestation gives some more insight into the new type of crypto that we're gonna be seeing in Extinction. The Cedar is what it's called and if you kill 15 cedar turrets in one game you get this achievement for it now next up on our list is big game trapper use the hypno trap to turn a rhino friendly now this is something that is awesome to see something that is really helpful in the standpoint of somebody playing extinction because if you've ever played extinction before the rhinos are the absolute worst thing to deal with they can be such a pain especially if you have multiple coming at you so turning one of these friendly would be one of the greatest helps and if you do that you also get an added bonus of an achievement now stepping outside of the extinction realm real quick here we're gonna move over to the multiplayer aspect of it we get to see the return of the extra xp challenge with these new devastation dlc maps now as with the past extra xp challenge you had to hit all the hives in the maps themselves as well as go in and get past the first barrier hive on extinction so doing that will get you this achievement as well as some extra xp to carry over into multiplayer now our final one on the list is the architect successfully build all the schematics in Mayday and that's something that is awesome to see we get some buildable pieces it sounds like and my guess is that it's going to add to the theme of the extinction backstory Easter egg whatever you want to call it and I'm guessing that this is going to be a lot harder to complete and it's going to be one of the things that is sought after and very crucial to our storyline. So you guys heard it here first up on my channel and up on Carnages. So let's show some huge support to this video. Leave a like rating down below. Smack that like button for us being the first ones up to get this to you guys on YouTube. You guys are going to be seeing a lot of this in the next couple hours as well as the next day or so before Extinction and the Devastation DLC pack is officially released. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did like the video, please leave a like rating down below. Any shares to your Facebook, Twitter, and or MySpace if you OG like that are always greatly appreciate it if you're new here be sure to subscribe for the best of Call of Duty content on my channel and if you're on carnages you're going to be seeing some amazing gameplays for the remainder of the life cycle of the channel so if you're on my channel go check out carnage and if you're on carnage please come check out my channel down in the description below it is very much appreciated on both ends so that's been my time ladies and gentlemen thank you guys so much for watching once again as always I hope you guys are having a great day i should see you guys later take care and peace